You can create a promo code in your site settings, provide it to your customer, and your customer can then apply it in the shopping cart during checkout to receive a discount. To create a promo code, open your site settings, go to your store section, select promo codes, and click add promo code. In the promo code field, enter the code that will be given to your customers. By clicking on the arrows in this field, you can generate a promo code value. In the promo code name field, enter a name for easier promo codes identification by you and your team, the name for internal use. In the discount type dropdown, choose either fixed amount or percentage. Enter the discount amount in the corresponding field, which can be a specific sum or a percentage depending on your choice in the previous item. You can set a percentage discount from 1% to 100%. Select which products you can apply the promo code to. It can be either all products or a specific product category. Save the created promo code. Additional settings for the promo code. The number of uses option allows you to define how many times a promo code can be used. You can either select unlimited or set a limit using the limited option. You can also set the time frame during which the promo code will be active or set it to have an unlimited validity period. In the Applies to Orders from field, you can set a limit on the order amount from which this promo code can be applied. In the Promo Code Notes field, you can add any comments you need. If you need to deactivate a promo code, click on its active status and select Inactive. You can also change the status in the General Promo Codes list. The Promo Code field will be displayed in the cart by default on all new websites. To hide this field, open your site editor, go to the page list in the upper left corner, Go to the Store tab and click on Shopping Cart. Then select the Order Details element, it is almost always the first element, and uncheck the Promo Code field checkbox. Publish your site to apply the changes. On a published website, this field will look like this.